Hey guys, it's Brian Storm. Welcome to the Halloween Experiment, where I purchased 50 of these Halloween collectibles between the prices of 500 and 1,000 coins. And we're going to be doing the Halloween Scary Swap Set, where you turn a Halloween collectible into anything your heart desires, including a Halloween collectible. But in the end, it'll likely be a player. Some people have reported pulling some pretty amazing cards, such as legend cards or like a Crosby or even gold collectibles. We got 25 here. And I'll do 25 after. Let's see what's inside. Starting with number one. I get it right back. Like a minute of my time wasted. Thank you, EA. Thank you. Oh my god. Wait, are they all going to be like this? Do, do I just keep doing this like thousands of times just because I keep getting getting them back? What the hell? Am I doing this right? Is this how you're supposed to do them? I, I could have sworn you got. I. I, mm, mm, I, I thought for sure you're going to get more like common players than anything. Holy crap. Five for five. Getting my collectibles back. Finally, Nick Holden, you're my hero. Now I don't have to waste more time by not by not having you or something. All right, that's, that's one collectible actually used. Chimera, great, great. No, it's not, but okay, okay. Here's where we get oh newest member of the Detroit Red Wings, Pumpel, Pumple, something like that. Another collectible. Oh, jeez. Clo. Alright, that's four players. Five players and more. There's more common cards than rare cards, so this shouldn't come as a surprise to me. Another collectible. Oi, these collectibles. Holy crap. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. Should I make it? Should I? They keep track of how many Halloween collectibles I get. Ulmark. Alright, let's 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 start from the end now. Not feeling those beginning ones. Gravel. Didn't even know there was a dude in the NHL named Gravel. Another Halloween collectible. Why would they do that? Why? Big schmaltz. Oh, we got our first rare card that's worth absolutely nothing. Woo! High five. Send for collection. Could have been a Crosby, though, you know? I definitely should have done 25. Because <laughs> now I'm going to have to go through all of these again. And I'll end up opening, like, hundreds of them. All right, well, that was 25 packs, sets, full of nothing. How many collectibles did I, get, did I keep? I, I bet you it was half of them. 38. Yeah, I got 13 out of 25 kept. Multi-select? Is this a thing? That's not a thing. How dare you? All right, guess we're uh, putting more collectibles in these sets. 25 was uh, not good enough. I guess this is good for getting the achievement, at least. But let's see what's inside another 25 scary swap packs. I'll guarantee right now, at least 10 collectibles. Not starting, what the? Whoa, Erickson, you look. You look like you just came out of the shower. Up next, Brower. All right, at least it's not collectibles. Again, something different. That's a collectible, I spoke too soon. And do you always get another collectible? No, that's probably not the case, but. Lazar. <sighs> Nothing. Nothing, nothing exciting. Come on, I have a chance to get any player I want. I think. Any player that's currently in packs, I think. And I keep getting crap. But again, I'm just happy I don't have to put them into the set again. The collectibles. Not all of them, anyway. Ben Smith. Another collectible. Want something big. Give me... Uh, what just happened? Oh, this is the wait. Is this what I got? There was no like animation or anything. Give me a uh, 
Give me a beret right now. That would be that would be amazing, wouldn't it? It's probably like the best card that I could get. Or oh yeah, yeah, I think it is. Forsberg, finally another rare card. Garbage though. Goes for like 1k. So that's the cost of the collectible. Okay, that's nothing too exciting, but quick sell for 2500 So I did just make, uh, you know, the price of like two and a half collectibles. Probably 5k at most. Clendenning. Emlyn. So as of right now, uh, I'm thinking you guys should not do what I'm doing right now. So not only is, has this been a waste of time, this has been a waste of coins. But things could change by the time I put in all 50 of them multiple times. Another rare card. That's three rare cards if you include the Team of the Week card in, like, what, five packs? No, not five packs. Maybe a little more than that. Five to ten packs. So we got uh, some greater luck here. Still nothing to go crazy about. Holy shit, Brian Rest! Oh, no, wait. Ah, oh, that's nobody. Never mind. I was just trying to go crazy over something that was nothing. Okay, now that... That is a good pull. <laughs> that's about 10k. The price of 10 collectibles. Doesn't make up for all the collectibles I spent. But... But... We'll take it. I think he's down to, like, 8k right now. So we'll throw him up for 8k. All right, all right. There, it's it's getting slightly better. So that's at least good news. And then when you top it off with two collectibles, that to put it into the sets again. So that was fifty packs right there. But I guess I should probably use the rest of the collectibles. Let's see how many we got left. Yeah, I guarantee ten collectibles. We got eleven. All right, another twenty-four incoming. Let's see if I can pull something better than a Taylor Hall. No, I can't. But can I pull something better than a Taylor Hall this time? Jason Palmville, didn't even know you were a rare card, to be honest. You don't you don't strike me as a rare card. But it is a rare card. And I mean last time we got the rare cards, like one after the other. So I'm I'm feeling good about this. I'm feeling good. We haven't had a common It's Brian Rust again. What are the chances of pulling two Brian Rusts in 50-something packs? Astronomically low. I think pulling a Crosby might be, uh, might be, like, higher probability than this. Thank you, Brian Rust. For showing your face again. Another rare card, Scott Darling. See, that's two rare cards in four packs. I'm feeling a third one. Crap. All right, I'm not, I'm not sure if I'm feeling a fourth one. But it was a rare card again. And a collectible. Okay. Okay. Just give me a carbon collectible. That will just end my troubles. Konechny, sad that you're a common card because you used to be a babe last year. Mrazic, another rare card. Come on. Come on, we're the high-end rare cards. High-end rare cards. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. We can do this. Not yet. We can do this one day. Take your time. Don't actually take your time. I want it right now. This one. This pack. Right here. Boom. Damn. It's Car Rick. My boy. From the Rick and Morty team build. I'm not putting, I'm not putting the, uh, the little animation there. Maybe I should. Should I? Ah, oh, I don't know. I, I think if it was anybody else, I'd be fine. But the car one sucked, in my opinion. I don't even know who we just pulled right before that Halloween collectible. Just nothing about that card made any sense to me. In my head, Reimer. Eh. 
This is such a waste of time. I think I've been recording for like an hour now. I'd rather be flipping cards, let me tell you. Clayton Stoner. Didn't know you got put on the Knights. I thought you were still on the Ducks. Griffin Molino? I don't know who you are. But I'm glad I'm expanding my player encyclopedia. Two more out of 24. We're getting to the final stretch. As they want me to open more packs, clearly. Jonathan Erickson. Instead of being sent to my collection, you're being quick sold. Because I feel like it. Boom. 11. 11 out of 24. Okay. So then this is going to take us to 85. Uh, another 11 hot potatoes coming right up. Starting with number one. Ghost is bare, not his Evo card. How dare you? How dare you? The Evo card was hiding there. It, like, it, there was probably like a 50-50 like a chance. Like, gosh, oh, should we give him the base card or the Evo card? They gave me the base card. How dare you? <laughs> Imagine getting it, like, right after. Two rares in a row. So that's a good sign. Right? Or is that all my luck? Jack Johnson. Damn. Nyquist, three rares out of four. Why is why is it so weird like that? Oh, a Halloween collectible. You know, getting another Halloween collectible makes me feel like I'm like, uh, like, getting scratch tickets, and like I pay twenty bucks for a scratch ticket, and I win twenty bucks. Like, gee, thanks. Guess I'm playing again. That's four Halloween collectibles in a row. Uh, I think we have to go to the last one. Colin Miller. Don't care. Another, another Halloween collectible. Great. And another one. Wow. Okay. We got six out of 11. I think that was. Another six. Will this all be for naught? Probably. Bernier. That sucks. But that Halloween collectible means this ride is not going to stop. Imagine if I got six Halloween collectibles out of all the six of these packs. You know, even five will be just as bad. Let me tell you. Please, please don't do this to me. Please, I don't. You think I want to keep playing this game, but I really don't. I mean, like, you know, this, this trade-in crap. We're going to wait for this one. We're going to wait for this one. We only got one new thing out of that. Last five. <laughs> Let's be honest. This is going to be another 20 packs. Matt Martin. Down to four. Please, please don't be, please don't be four collectibles in a row. Don't do it. I feel like I should go back now and reset it. I'm, I'm going back and resetting it. I'm superstitious like that. Not really, but it is the Halloween October pack thing. God damn it. Back is. Yeah. Dahlbeck. Okay. Okay. Guess we got two left then. It's definitely still two. Clarkson. Great. Last one. This is going to be the big one before the big one. Come on, Burry. Is that Burry wearing a Halloween costume? All right, last one. Again. It's Burry in a Halloween costume. It has to be. So now he's going to take off the Halloween costume and get, there's another costume underneath. <laughs> another mask. This is like Scooby Doo. Of course it is. All right, last one for the third time. Please, no collectible. Please, no collectible. Please, Burray. Please, Burray. Come on, Burray. Oh, my God. I'm getting every collectible one by one. <laughs> but it's all about to be worth it, right? 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 No. No, it wasn't. No. 
No. Get out. Don't want to see you. I got coins. Yay. Wow. Uh... Wow. I would just like to mention that EA just made me do a giveaway on accident because of their broken game not completing my set. I'm also so glad that I didn't uh, accidentally bid 1 million on a collectible because then I'd probably quit the game before I get banned for doing like a giveaway or something. Now we gotta check out this, this $17,000 coin, coin dollar collectible. This is the big one. This is the one that matters. And now we're going to open it up. And there's going to be a beret. There's a beret in a Matt Poompel costume. Damn it. <laughs> All right. Well, that was uh, all those collectibles. We got like 40 common players. Nine no, eight crappy rare players. We got the Team of the Week Taurus, and we got the Taylor Hall, who go for maybe like 12k total. So 12k plus a bunch of garbage for, I think I spent maybe 40k total. You, you don't need to see the data. Point is, they're not worth it. Maybe for like 100 coins, they might be. I don't know. Although, honestly, maybe, maybe if there were 500 coins, it would probably be close to breaking even. Even lower than that. But that's still if you pull like a Taylor Hall or something. Because that's really the, the whole point of that. But hopefully this video has shown you something. I don't know if it did. Probably didn't. Just just sell your Halloween collectibles is what I'm trying to tell you. Sure, you should have done that sooner when they were worth like 7k. But now they're worth 1k and they're kind of like useless and worthless.